Hello guys welcome to my new video. 2024 Nissan Altima Expert Review Alex Leans a staple of affordable transportation. The Nissan Altima is one of America's best known mid-size sedans. Although the Altima has been in production for decades, the current generation was introduced for the 2019 model year. The midsize sedan is produced in Smyrna, Tennessee, alongside the Rogue, Murano, and other Nissan models. Competitors to the 2024 Nissan Altima include the Toyota Camry, Honda Accord, and Kia K5. Collapse all Chevron. What's new Chevron for 2024? The Altima carries over unchanged other than a $100 price increase on all trim levels. The Altima underwent a more substantial update for 2023, which brought styling updates, new wheel designs, an available 12.3 inch infotainment touch screen, and more standard safety features, among other changes. What we think Chevron in a world where compact crossovers are taking over, why are you looking at a sedan? And if you are looking at a sedan, why are you looking at the Nissan Altima? We'd bet factors like its starting price, chiseled styling, available turbocharged engine, and optional all-wheel drive drew you in. Those are the Altima's strong suits, but it has some issues. Two. Regardless of how it's equipped, the Altima doesn't ride very well. Furthermore, its CVT automatic makes the driving experience dreary, even with the strong VC turbo engine. Compliant yet uninspiring handling only dulls the experience further. In the sense that it comes equipped with many useful driver assist features, the Altima is high tech. However, even its large 12.3 inch optional touch screen runs a user interface that feels behind the times, and the backup camera is low resolution. The Altima gets the job done, but there are better options. Nissan's own Rogue Compact crossover is a solid choice, but if you want a sedan, we'd steer you elsewhere. Performance and MPG's Chevron The Altima's standard engine is a 2.5-liter i4 that produces 188 horsepower and 180 pounds to feet of torque when paired with FWD. With optional AWD, Output falls to 182 horsepower and 178 pounds to feet. A CVT automatic is used either way. When we tested an AWD Altima, it accelerated from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 8.0 seconds. Fuel economy for the 2024 Altima should rate at 2737 to 39 miles per gallon city, highway with FWD, and 2636 with AWD. How quick is the Altima VC Turbo? Chevron what is VC Turbo? The two letters mean variable compression, an engine technology exclusive to Nissan. Turbo means a well, you know what it means. The VC Turbo badge is applied to Nissan's 2.0 liter turbocharged i4 engine, which makes 236 horsepower and 267 pounds to feet of torque on regular gas or 248 horsepower and 273 pounds to feet on 93 octane fuel. A CVT automatic and FWD put that power to the ground. We measured an Altima VC Turbo's 0 to 60 mile per hour time at 5.8 seconds. 
fuel economy comes in at about 25 34 mile per gallon. Safety ratings and features Chevron Nissan includes its Safety Shield 360 suite of driver assist and active safety features on every 2024 Altima model. Among these features are front and rear automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, and automatic high beams. Optional or available depending on trim are additions such as road sign recognition and adaptive cruise control. Expect the 2024 Altima to receive similarly strong safety scores to the 2023 model, which earned a 5 star NASA rating and top safety pick plus designation from it, each the highest possible rating. Cargo space and interior room Chevron There's a great deal of leg room in the Altima's front row, although long legged drivers should check out the Super Room IKEA K5. However, the Altima's second row seats are much tighter, especially compared to the Honda Accord. Furthermore, the Nissan's headroom and cargo space aren't great. Leg room, front slash rear, cargo space, seats up, down, 2024 Nissan Altima 43.8 35.2 inches 15.4 cubic feet 2024 Honda Accord 42.3 40.8 inches 16.7 cubic feet 2024 Kia K5 46.1 35.2 inches 16.0 cubic feet Technology Chevron on the Altima S base trim, a 7.0 inch infotainment touch screen and 5.0 inch gauge cluster display are equipped. Stepping up to the SV trim nets an 8.0 inch touch screen and 7.0 inch gauge display. The high-end Altima SL and SRV C Turbo models get a 12.3-inch infotainment touchscreen with built-in navigation. Models with the smallest screen lack Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, but those features are added on the 8.0-inch touchscreen and made wireless on the 12.3-inch touchscreen. One USB port is standard rear seat ports are added on higher trims, and a wireless charging pad is available. Recommended trim Chevron The 2024 Altima range starts with the S-Trim, which goes for around $26,800, and tops out at the VC Turbo, priced from about $36,500. Our pick in the lineup is the Altima SV, one step up from the base model. Choosing that configuration nets you useful features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, as well as a push button starter and USB ports in both rows of seats. The SV looks sharper, too, thanks to its 17 inch wheels, an upgrade from the S model's hubcaps. Considering it also includes so many safety features, the 2024 Altima SV is a solid value at around $27,600. Thanks for watching my video please subscribe my channel and like my video.